That's not freezing, Wilson. There is Yukidis. And right now, I am learning how to make uh, origami butterflies. I got this book at the library yesterday. And so this was the first um, butterfly, uh, a butterfly for Alice Gray. And this was my first attempt. And I'm pretty pleased with it. <laughs> Still, you see, kind of messy, but I think with practice, it could get a little better. I'm going to try it a few more times. I also got help from this um, YouTube video with a few parts where I couldn't really understand the images. So as you can see, Yuki's here keeping me company. So I made more of the... Um, Alice butterflies. So I, I have this one here. Oh, sorry. And then there is this one here. And then I have these two where I was just playing around and they were like failed attempts. So I can't play around yet. Right, Yuki. I need to first learn, practice, and follow directions. You don't care and then um, okay so this was the first one and second no I think this was the second one so it's first this one and then there is this one and then I'm pretty sure I made this one third and then I'm trying to make this one the Tony Chung one but uh, I was struggling a bit with this part here because it's basically the same thing as the Alice one, but it has this um, color stripe that appears here. And I was struggling and um, folding it and then it kind of got a little beat up. So I'm going to try to make another one. And Yuki's going to keep me company, huh, you kitties? So sleepy. This is my default dinner of um, spaghetti with um, butter, pesto, and Parmesan cheese, and tomatoes. It's very yummy. Probably very high in calories. <laughs> <laughs> So I just finished my um, Chinese class and uh, before that like I had um, family study with my roommate which consisted of just studying the watchtower and then before that my sister came and we did some letter writing and before that I was resting after work. So today's been a um, somewhat productive day, chill day. Um, I really need to go wash up, go to bed. I have to write some, they're called CCs um, at school. What are, what are they mean? Conversation corner, conversation corner. I need to write up about um, winter camp, like how the kids did and stuff. It's kind of weird because usually we don't do it during um, the summer camp or winter camp. I don't know why I have to do it for this camp, but oh well. And it's due um, by Friday, so I'm debating whether to try to get some done right now. But it's like 9 something and I'm tired, so I'm thinking of just going to sleep early and then just doing it tomorrow after work.
I got myself some duck today. So um, at this place, they don't have that many like side dish options. So they only have the ones that were there. So it looks like there's just radish, tofu, and boiled lettuce. And kotomi. It's smelling my food is not for you. No. <laughs> okay. Looks pretty good. So it turns out that I'm working tomorrow morning. I thought I wasn't going to. The thing is that I had a chiropractor's appointment, so I asked for the day off, but then my chiropractor asked to change the time, and so I was like, oh, well, I guess I'll just still have that day off. But then my boss forgot that I asked for that day off, and so they were, like, freaking out today when I was like, oh, I'm not coming tomorrow, and they're like, what? But then, you know, because that my chiropractor did change the time to later, that means that I am free, so I'm going to go help them out. And um, today was super cute um, because we were there, there was not that much to do today, and so we were talking about, um, you know, being healthy, and one of the things that we kind of branched into was like your feelings and emotions and stuff like that and it was kind of cool going through the list of things like happy and like different types of happiness and like sad and I was getting them from this like emotion wheel that I found on Google and it was super cute to be like asking them like have you ever felt like this or have you ever experienced this and to have kids like I have a few of them that understand a lot of English and they were very attentive and they're like yes yes like I've I've experienced that um so that was super cute and um, afterwards they danced and we have a five-year-old little Ellie her name's Elsa but we have two Elsa so I call her Ellie because she's the little one and she like is five but she has like rhythm like I could see it and I can when I when she's dancing and it's super super cute and um, so yeah I'm trying to think nothing else really interesting happened today you know just my kids are cute as usual same old, same old. Um, later today, I have to go to Costco with my roommate. We're going to go see if they have the chicken I would like for the pozole this Sunday. Um, I'm still, like, recovering from the cold. Like, the fatigue is not that bad, but I'm still, like, tired. Like, I've, I've been home for... Let me see how long I've been home. What time is it? I can't make my phone tell me. Okay, it's 3.39. So I got home... 3.39? I got home... Um... Around maybe like... 2? Maybe? Maybe before that? And I've just been like laying down and relaxing. <laughs> Watching YouTube videos. Messaging Mariah. I think that's about it. Uh, I need to do something productive. So I'm going to try to do that. Do something productive before I go to Costco. Oh yeah, I have the CCs. I still need to do them. I didn't. I didn't do them yesterday. I need to do them. So I think I'll work on that um, after I eat a snack or something.